Not only is Johannesburg the heart of the financial district, it also is host to a vibrant art scene. Entrepreneurs from across the continent seek to make their fortunes here, so let's take a look. Benon Lutaye is a Ugandan-born artist who has made a name for himself in Johannesburg's versatile art scene. Lutaye uses material collected from the streets, like discarded paper, to set the tone and texture of his collages and plastic telephone cards as palette knives. The artist started painting on the streets of Kampala, Uganda, where as a street child, he did not have money to buy sophisticated art equipment, so he would pick up what was readily available. What started out as a passion to create art has become a unique style that is highly respected by his peers today. I go out on the streets. That has been my story from the day, from day one. Go out and pick up resources, papers, any waste, because I could not afford to buy art supplies and try to play with it to create art. Letaya uses his personal experiences as inspiration for his art, most of which consists of collage portraits of street children. The images represent survival of marginalized groups in society, he says. He also says his style provides a channel for fresh inspiration. When I'm painting, I try to mix my colors on papers so that when I'm not in a mood to paint, I can go back and pick up those papers and collage because that's where I, originally where I'm coming from. Letaya started his professional career in 2009 in Uganda and relocated to Johannesburg, South Africa's capital in 2011 on a residency program at the Bag Factory, a hub for local artists. The 27-year-old says he arrived in the country with nothing but a dream. At the bag factory, he met a lot of artists who inspired him, and he decided his art stood a better chance of success in Johannesburg than in his home country. Letaya recently held his first solo exhibition at the Room Art Gallery, titled Beyond the Subject, Between the Intentional and the Accidental. He has participated in a number of group exhibitions in Uganda, South Africa, and Europe. His work is present in a variety of private collections in South Africa and most recently in the Element Contemporary Public Art Gallery in Cape Town. The artist's work has attracted both local and international attention and guests at his exhibition gave him rave reviews. This uh, exhibition highlights the sort of the progress achieved in his way of work. His work has become so incredibly good. It's literally skyrocketing. He's literally got people begging him to do work for him. And it's this integrity and this pushing of himself that, that makes it interesting and dynamic. Letaya will hold more solo exhibitions in Cape Town, Johannesburg and Chelsea this year.